Hello everybody, you're watching Ad-Free Tenacious Viking TV. Welcome back to Sim Airport. I'm Tenacious Viking, your airport manager and host. Well, there has been a big update to Sim Airport, and the best thing about the update is, I'm not even sure what they call it, PAX Flow. It shows a number of, it shows people movement basically through the airport. Green is departure passengers, red is arrival passengers, cyan is for connecting flight passengers, magenta is the flight crew, and yellow is the airport staff, and you can switch to some other views with, uh, with the tab. But if you look at, uh, if you look at, at, at analyze what, what I have here, um, obviously the arrivals are waiting to get down the steps and, and out the door. Um, these steps actually control the flow so that there isn't a bunch of people trying to force their way through that narrow passage, which I may look at widening at some, at some point, especially when I add more stairs and escalators, which I plan to do. Now, this is the ground floor, but you're seeing both floors at once, so it can be a little confusing. But, but at a glance, you can see that uh, right here, the, the line to the, uh, to the uh, security is there's a lot of people built up there. Uh, you also have a lot of people waiting to, to leave uh, on the, the train um, and a steady stream of people going out the door, which is not too bad. Um, it's, I can live with that, I guess. Um, you have a lot more people going to the um, ticketing kiosks than you do going into the ticket line, which says rather than adding more ticket lines, we probably ought to add more ticket kiosks. I'm just not exactly sure where. <laughs> Uh, yellow is staff. You should have staff all over. Look at this. In the arcade room, you have both departing and arriving passengers. Uh, restrooms, mostly departing, a few arrivals. Um, here you have uh, people getting onto the plane. Let's go to the second floor and see what we can tell from that. Uh, I see you still see the reds leaving the building on, on the first floor. But on, on the second floor, you can see a few people hanging around. Uh, some flight crew hanging around. There's a lot of space here. I guess that's where a, a gate will, will need to be. Um, departing people on the lower floor. So that, I, I think, will be um, a nice uh, addition uh, of information for us to, uh, to help me see where uh, bottlenecks are. Um, and and this is this is one that I I think I have to address. I think I need more of the um, ID stands, check stands. There's you know it's not too crowded here because only a few people can get through. But but we're not getting enough people through these uh, uh, these stands here uh, quickly enough. So we need to figure something out there. Um, and and I had planned to expand this anyway, so it's it's not a it's not a big deal. But um, the other, uh, the other biggest thing I think is you can now build in any direction, including over here. Remember, I wanted to build down this way, and I couldn't, so I had to change my my plan uh, for how to do this. And, and now I could, but it's very expensive. Apparently, the more you buy, the more it costs. I don't know. Maybe though, maybe the costs have gone up. Maybe they thought they were too cheap. But what I would like to do is buy this piece of land and build uh, a building here for train uh, passengers, and then and then a uh, an underground uh, conveyor belt and escalator to get into the lobby. Now, the problem is you're going to be using this lower level where I already have all the baggage stuff. <laughs> so I'm hoping I can get it to work right here, but I don't know because it's kind of... Well, I guess I could. I have a shot at getting uh, two escalators in here. I'll have to move the fountain somewhere. But I, I, can, I think I might be able to get a couple escalators in here to bring people to and from that area I just I hope that works I'm gonna have to build this first so I know where to put the building because otherwise I'm gonna mess it up I know I am I wonder if eventually I could put a third it'd be nice if I could put a, a third floor walkway across the third story second I think would be too low but uh, I'm not sure so that's in the plans um, to, to build a building here because I hate having passengers have to walk across the highway and you know I'm gonna gonna have a, a a double uh, width highway at some point so yeah uh, I like that that you can see um, 
I thought I extended that to longer than that. Yeah. It's supposed to be a 15 minute save. Um, I like that you can see flight crew. Let's see. Oh, there's uh, some flight crew. They're supposed to be in a lounge, but they're not. Staff is, but... Uh, I'm not sure. Are they on the second floor then? Yeah, they're they're waiting to get on the on the plane. Um, but I like that you can see flight crew because every once in a while I have a flight that's delayed because the flight crew isn't there, and and that drives me a little crazy. I'd like to be able to see. There are no flight crew waiting to go through security. They don't need tickets, obviously. So now I don't know what this is telling me here. Do one for, um, I'm getting. Can I can I click on somebody? Yeah, I can. Okay. Uh, so I can kind of tell what they uh, what they're thinking here. Nope. Uh -huh. Oh, if I get right on the outside of the, but I had to follow them then, or I lose it. Okay, so I can see what they want. I'd like to be able to. S Maybe pause that. Can I do that? Nope. Can't see a thing and pause. Uh, I'd like to, oh, there I can. Hunger, 66%. I'm not sure. Okay, that means they're hungry. All right. Check bag not carried. Okay. I go over here. Boredom. Uh, I'm not sure. Okay, red is serious information and environment um, not sure what that means I thought the higher the percentage the better it was but this looks the opposite of that so I'm not sure I don't know who I'm following so I can't tell anything so that's dumb Okay, never mind. I'm not sure why staff are moving through here. Uh, they should be <coughs> at their station. So that's interesting. Hmm. Uh, Pax AI decision, sector display, secure areas. We've got PA speakers. I still have to tweak that a little bit. Uh, environment heat map. Um, ground floor is looking okay. Uh, second floor is a little weak, especially down here. Um, and information heat map. Ground floor, eh, basic. Uh, second floor, I feel like I need more. Maybe something down here somewhere. Maybe I need one in the first class lounge even. I'm not sure. I could put something here perhaps. A, a screen or something. Um, yeah, that would work. Alright, let's see what uh, one or more garbage zones are full. Oh dear. Okay. Um, I thought I was keeping up with the um, oh boy, with the uh, dumpsters, but I'm not. So uh, let me add uh, garbage zoning. Garbage, garbage, garbage. How do you spell garbage? There we go. Because I'm I'm be moving this back pretty soon anyway, so I might as well go over now. Uh, about three. Why can't I? Uh, Why can't I do that? Um, yeah, I'm not able to add to the garbage zone right now. Let me, um, let me try, uh, oops. Let me try objects, ops. I'll put some dumpsters in, <clears throat> but I don't know if it'll take them because there's other stuff there already. So there's not much I can do, and I, I don't know why. Um, I wonder if I can do a separate one then.
Um, let's see if I can do a separate this is a garbage zone here. I don't really want to put it here. Well, I'll put it here. Is it because it's paused? No, it's not. It's not that. Can I put other zones in? <laughs> put a kitchen zone in here? No, I can't do zones right now for some reason. Um, hmm. Well, I'll have to muddle through um, if I can catch that the garbage truck has come. Um, I'll have to uh, put in some dumpsters, but I don't know if I can catch that. <clears throat> Um, in any case, um, before I get to all those things, I, um, let's see, well, we gotta see if we can do something with this, uh, with this security area, don't we? I don't even have the floor done here yet, good lord. Oh, I like that I can get more information from these guys now. Uh... I just, I don't know how that translates to this. Oh, that's interesting. Fully satisfied, mildly unsatisfied, very unsatisfied. Okay, that helps. Now I understand what's going on. Okay. So, frustration and environment. Needs satisfaction. Okay, time analysis. I don't know what this means. I I don't know. That's a that's a new that's a new thing. Let me see what else they've done here. Okay, that seems to be the same. The flight status, uh, the flight management is good. They're talking about adding overnight flights in the future. Perhaps. Research and development. Oh, credit reporting it allows access to detailed credit reports and provides pre-application interest rate estimates for loans. Okay, let's research that. Bag hub boosters allows construction of baggage hub boosters for increased sorting throughput on your hubs. That's a good thing to research. I'd see if there's anything else that needs to be needs to be researched now. Okay, so we got that. Um, finance hub. Yeah, there's a new loan thing. You can basically borrow as much as you want, but the interest rate goes up depending on how much you borrow. So Five hundred thousand is a good place to start. Outstanding principal. You can repay. Credit report requires credit reporting research. Okay, I've got that coming. Profit and loss. That's that's all right. Cash. Flow uh, expenses have dropped considerably. Airport value is up to nine million dollars. Perfect ops bonus. Bonus achieved. Nope. <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't know what the bonus is. I really don't. I, don't know. I have no idea. No. Huh. Not sure what that's supposed to be, but I'm gonna leave it like that. Because that's probably what I'm going to need. Staffing is supposed to be... Yeah, you got hire staff, manage staff. I'm not sure what you can do here. Uh, kiosk scheduling, of course, you have. Um, and and uh, kia, uh, staff scheduling is coming soon. They don't have it implemented in this version. Um, I think this is all standard. Wait, I've got... Zones build zones. That doesn't make any sense to me that there's two of those and they're this I think something's wrong with that. I think there's a bug in this this menu. Um but I'm not sure. Uh how many you see are these guys um this is a attached to what? It's, I don't want the security guard. I want the I want the object. Check stand. Okay, that's assigned. That goes to that one, and this goes to that one as well. So those 
This line goes to these two, which is odd, because that's uh, kind of limited. That's the um, sine two first class and flight crew, and I've got one line going to two stands. That's no, that's not right. I can I can fix uh, that pretty pretty quickly by changing that. Come on to this one instead. There. Uh, that'll get more people going through these. I don't remember what kind of flooring this is, but it shouldn't be hard to find, should it? I wonder if that works. Need that really dark wood. Um, oh, no, maybe not. I don't know where it went. Maybe it's... Oh, it's this black. Okay. Stone 20. Stone 20. There we go. We'll get that filled in. Um, <clears throat> and then I, I still think I need to... Uh, I need to uh, take this wall out now. And uh, maybe what I'll do is put a staff door in there. No, I don't, I don't really want to do that. I'm going to anyway. Well, I can't because it's now set for removal. So I'm going to take the wall out. <laughs> I don't care. Let's just get this thing done. But I don't know what that is now. Oh, that's... Uh, Okay, that's that's dumb. That's uh, I had that still had that on flooring. I thought I had it cleared, and that's not doing anything. Good lord! <sighs> oh, that is that's that's how it's marked for for removal now. Okay, all right, whatever. We might as well just do the whole flooring on this thing now, I guess. We're going to use up our whole um, episode just to see what's new and then to get... Uh, some of this stuff done. Where did that black... There we go. Flooring go. And we're not going to get that in one. So we'll foop. Can we get the rest of the wall, buddy? And get the flooring in, too. Oh, he's got the flooring. Okay. So he'll work on that. One more. There we go. Oh, walk right through the deal. Okay. Whatever. there. So we get that flooring in and, and uh, get us positioned to add some more if this doesn't work. Um, wish there was a way to uh, to see what that um, visualize cues. Okay. And, and to see what this cue is without having to go into the, the uh, assigned to. I think this is coach. Yellow is coach. So I wonder if we, I don't know. Is it too crowded here to get to this queue maybe? I mean, that's part of it, huh? <sighs> I have to ponder that a little bit. But i got to be careful because I need the space for that uh, escalator to bring people from the other side. Yeah. Okay. Do we have any increased uh, airline interest? Uh, flight schedule. We got a couple of couple of flights. That's it. Just a couple. Not good enough. Not good enough. 
All right, well, we're going to have to end it there. My time is up for this episode. But what I'd like to do uh, for next time, if you noticed I moved the plants out from the middle, it's because I want to put in a walkway here uh, in both directions and see what that does to overall passenger flow. Um, I really don't need one past here. In fact, I maybe shouldn't because of the restrooms, but I'm probably going to anyway. I don't know what I'm going to put in here to either. I no clue. No clue. I guess just a lounge area. Maybe a bar. I don't know. We'll see. Problem is i got too many doors here. I guess I could sneak a bar in along here. I should put windows in too to look over the, the you know, over to the, the planes. So I'll, I'll ponder that. Um, and then uh, and then decide how long I want the um, the moving sidewalk to be. Um, should be able to get it goes up. Uh, I'm gonna have to start here and go this way, and then, or actually this way, and then back that way. And I think I'm gonna go to about to the restroom doors. Is what I'm gonna do. We'll we'll work on that next time, and uh, we might go to the second floor and do the same thing. I've got. I, I guess I have the plants kind of out of the way there also. So um, we'll we'll try to do that. We'll try moving uh, moving walkways on both floors. And uh, see how that works. See what uh, what it does, and then also be checking my operations a little more, and uh, see what we can do to increase passenger satisfaction. But I wanted you to see the uh, some of the new things uh, that have come to pass, um, and I'll I'll alert you to more as I uh, as I discover them or remember them or get to use them. Uh, I think we also need to try to uh, lengthen this runway, but I don't have the money for it, and um, yeah. Because uh, I have to redo the whole runway, basically. So that'll be exciting. All right. Thank you so much for watching. Welcome new subscribers. And uh, join me next time when Tenacious Viking plays Sim Airport. And remember, be kind. Oh.